at the GP and um, by chance she decided to do a check, a breast check and a pap smear and she wasn't happy with um, a lump that she found in my breast so she sent me on to, to get it examined. So I was really shocked, I think given my age, I was only 35 at the time and I think you know, I always thought I was invincible, so um, yeah, and I was extremely healthy. I watched what I ate. I was in the process of training to do a half marathon. I think the hardest thing out of all of it was losing my hair, and that really impacted uh, my little girl who, who was four at the time. Um, she was absolutely devastated, so I think that was the hardest part for me. <laughs> Um, cancer Council through my oncologist um, because um, I actually said to my oncologist that I want to become quite active in raising awareness. Pink Ribbon Day is so important because it creates awareness um, and especially awareness for younger people who, who think that um, breast cancer cannot affect them. Um, it's also a, a great opportunity to raise much needed funds um, in order to find a cure, uh, a, a vaccination maybe in the future. Mm -hmm.